Hi there, my name is Rhys. I'm from the Grove Hotel over in Hertfordshire and I'm here today to show you how to make our perfect bread and butter pudding using our leftover Danish pastries. Now a quick reason why we're doing this with Danish pastries, it has the butter content, so you don't need butter inside the recipe. It reduces wastage uh, and it's very quick and easy to make. So we're just going to finish off our custard mix here using our Kerry Made Double and we're just going to add the remaining 500 grams. That Kerry Made Double is a perfect alternative to use in this recipe. It does not split when it comes to cooking. Um, and it's very versatile. How we're going to do, we've got our Danish pastries here that have been cut up into roughly the same size. We're just going to pour our custard mix over the top. And we're just going to layer our croissants over the top. Now when we come to cooking this, we're going to cook this at about 150 degrees for approximately 20 to 30 minutes. The remaining custard just goes over the top. Place that in the oven. So after 20 to 30 minutes cooking time, and we're going to glaze that with an apricot glaze using equal quantities of jam and water. And here you have our signature bread and butter pudding using leftover Danish pastries from this morning's service. And in this recipe we've used the Kerry Made Double and the perfect accompaniment to serve with this dish would be the Kerry Made Single or even the Kerry Made Custard. 